In a historic milestone for Russia's naval prowess, the Russian Navy has officially commissioned its fifth Bory A class nuclear powered ballistic missile submarine, Kinyaz Pozharsky, on July 24, 2025, at the Sevmash shipyard in Severodvinsk. This state of the art vessel, equipped with 16 Bulova Intercontinental Ballistic Missiles, ICBMs, each capable of carrying up to 10 nuclear warheads, marks a significant leap in Russia's strategic defense capabilities. The commissioning ceremony, attended by President Vladimir Putin and high-ranking officials, including First Deputy Prime Minister Denis Menturov and Commander-in-Chief of the Navy Alexander Moiseev, was a testament to Russia's unwavering resolve to strengthen its maritime forces. President Putin emphasized the submarine's role in safeguarding national security, stating, The Knyaz Pajarsky is a pinnacle of modern technology designed to ensure Russia's strategic nuclear deterrence and protect our interests in the global arena. This latest addition to the Russian Navy's fleet is a bold statement of resilience and technological superiority, particularly in the face of growing geopolitical tensions with the West. The Bor IA class, an advanced iteration of the Project 955-955 A series, represents a significant upgrade over its predecessors. Measuring 170 meters in length, with a submerged displacement of 24,000 tons, the Kinyaz Pajarsky is powered by a 170 megawatts OK650W OK nuclear reactor and a pump jet propulsion system, enabling it to reach speeds of up to 29 knots while maintaining exceptional acoustic stealth. Russian state media reports claim its noise level is five times lower than the third-generation Akula-class submarines and two times lower than the U.S. Virginia-class submarines, making it one of the stealthiest submarines in the world. This stealth capability, combined with the advanced Irtish Amphora Bore sonar system, provides unparalleled situational awareness, allowing the Knyaz Pozharsky to evade detection and execute its deterrence missions with precision. The submarine's primary armament, the R-30 Bulova missile, is a cornerstone of Russia's nuclear triad. Each of the 16 Bulova missiles on board can deliver between 6 and 10 independently targetable nuclear warheads, with a range exceeding 10,000 kilometers. This capability ensures that the Knyaz Pozharsky can strike targets across the globe, reinforcing Russia's second strike capability, a critical component of its strategic deterrent strategy. Additionally, the submarine is equipped with six 533mm torpedo tubes, capable of launching torpedoes and anti-submarine rockets, making it versatile in both nuclear and conventional warfare scenarios. The commissioning of the Kanyaz Pozharsky is part of Russia's broader naval modernization program which aims to replace aging Soviet-era submarines like the Delta III and Typhoon classes with cutting-edge vessels. The Borier class, designed by the Rubin Marine Equipment Design Bureau and constructed by Sevmash, incorporates significant improvements in maneuverability, acoustic stealth, and crew habitability. Notably, the Knyaz Podzarsky features an Aspen Banya, a traditional Russian sauna, accommodating three to four crew members, enhancing morale during long deployments. With a crew of 107, the submarine is designed for efficiency and endurance, capable of operating under the Arctic ice caps and patrolling critical regions like the Barents Sea. Russia's investment in its submarine fleet reflects its strategic foresight in an era of heightened global competition. The Kinyaz Pozarsky joins four other Borae class submarines, Kinyaz Vladimir, Knyaz Oleg, Generalissimus Suvorov, and Imperator Alexander III, as well as three original Project 955 Borai submarines. With plans to acquire a total of 12 Borai-class submarines by 2031, Russia is steadily building a formidable underwater arsenal. Two additional Borai A submarines, Dmitry Donskoy and Knyaz Potiemkin, are currently under construction, and the Russian Navy has already ordered two Borai AM submarines a next-generation variant to further enhance its capabilities.
This ambitious expansion underscores Russia's determination to maintain naval supremacy and counter NATO's growing presence in strategic waters. The Kinyas Pozarsky's induction into the Northern Fleet, based in Gajievo, strengthens Russia's ability to conduct deterrence patrols in the Arctic and beyond. Its advanced stealth technologies and long-range strike capabilities make it a critical asset in countering Western military dominance. As NATO continues to expand its naval exercises and deploy assets in the North Sea and Arctic, Russia's Boraya submarines serve as a powerful reminder of Moscow's ability to project power and defend its interests. The submarine's ability to operate undetected under ice caps and deliver precision strikes makes it a strategic game-changer, ensuring Russia's security in an unpredictable geopolitical landscape. Western analysts have expressed concern over the Bori A-class's capabilities, with some describing it as a, quote, significant upgrade for the Russian Navy. The combination of stealth, advanced sonar, and the Bolova missile system poses a formidable challenge to U.S. and NATO naval defenses. Unlike the U.S. Navy's Ohio-class submarines, which are nearing the end of their service life, the Bori A-class is a modern, purpose-built platform designed to dominate the seas for decades. The Kinyaz Pozarsky's ability to carry up to 160 nuclear warheads, as reported by some sources, amplifies its role as a cornerstone of Russia's nuclear strategy, capable of deterring any potential aggressor. The commissioning of the Kinyaz Pozarsky marks a triumphant step forward for Russia's naval ambitions, with its advanced technology, unmatched stealth, and devastating firepower. This fifth Bory class submarine solidifies Russia's position as a global leader in submarine warfare. As the world watches, Russia continues to demonstrate that its navy is not only a force to be reckoned with, but also a vital pillar of its national defense strategy, ensuring peace through strength in an uncertain world.